Pass is back. It's chapter 10. Let's get into it. Oh, man. Isaac, I've located the shuttle Hammond found. <sighs> Shit. No good. That shuttle's brain Where's dead. Some Someone removed There's the navigation card. <laughs> God knows why. There's three of them scattered around the deck. I'm downloading their locations. Okay. I can't access the doors from here, so you'll need a crew key. If you can find those parts, I think we can get that shuttle operational again. Okay. Mm so we're trying to escape now and in the last episode hammond died very very gruesomely and now we've got to try and i guess activate this vessel so that's what we're gonna go and try and do so onward to glory my friends let's see what happens <laughs> Dude, like, there's some chick or girl, woman, whatever, singing Twinkle Twinkle in a very eerily way. It's very unsettling. <laughs> I don't know, man. That's so weird. Ah. I'm still wondering what that is. I know a couple videos ago, I forget which episode it was, but we had it. It was playing. And it was just interesting. United We Ascend. Is Unitology a New Hope or Just Another Scam? By Carrie Van Oakden. Or Ockkin. If you've been living on Mars for the past 200 years, you might have missed the fast-growing religious movement in history. Unitology boasts a following of millions, counts powerful CEOs and officials in its ranks, claims $78 billion of stock in multi-global companies, and owns two of Earth's financial institution or largest financial institutions, GPSG Financial and Unitas Energy Investments, or Unitas, from its beginning as a cult of personality, Unitology has become a respected, established religion. Most people know the basics. 200 years ago, Michael Altman, a professor of anthropology, blew the whistle on what he claimed was the biggest cover-up ever instituted by Earth government, the discovery of an artifact or marker, which proved beyond any doubt there is an alien life in the universe. The government labeled Altman a kook, but his claims stuck or struck a chord with some, and his mysterious death soon afterwards fueled that interest. Unitologists believed that the marker contained a code key to eternal life through rebirth and ascension to heaven. The kicker is you have to die first. They say that the government is hiding the marker somewhere, keeping it secrets for themselves. Across all of human space, Unitologists praise Altman's martyrdom and await the day God comes to take them to their new life beyond death. It all sounds pretty harmless, but like any cult, there's a dark side. Unitologists are ranked in the church. Nobody ever talks about it, but most of its critics believe there are at least three ranks above the average believer or initiate. With each new rank, more of the church's inner workings and research is revealed to a follower, and these ranks are achieved by one simple criteria, giving money and power to the church. Or think tanking all your money's bad? The church also requires members to donate their bodies after death. Why? What do they want with them? Nobody will say. And attempts to infiltrate the inner circle have failed. With their emphasis on transformation and rebirth, maybe we wouldn't like the answer even if they told us. One rumor that also refuses to die says the church is funding a secret shipbuilding program. Some claim to have seen the fleet. No documentary evidence has ever been supplied, but the cla claimants all say these mausoleum ships despite their huge size continued on page 94 okay sounds a lot like a certain religion or cult member in hollywood that i won't say the name but i'm sure y'all know what i'm talking about let's see what we can upgrade nothing we could upgrade nothing we have no nodes 
All right, let's continue on. What in the world? Oh, it's this guy again. So utterly hopeless around you. Delphine Cross was a true believer. She had faith. And now she awaits her transformation. What in the world? Reaper, are you ready to ascend, Mr. Temple? Of course you are. Have no fear. You will play your part soon enough. Dude, leave him alone. Witness the conviction. Oh, no. Nothing like a railroad spike to the head. Holy crap. Take him. Embrace them. All right. That dude's kind of kooky. And I don't like the sticky room. All this sticky stuff around. I'm not sure what's going to be fun here. I feel like I'm about to miss something. I see you going down. He's still dead. The rooms are available. And the creepy music has started. What could possibly go wrong? All right, we got to go through this door, it says. Okay, so... I'm guessing... Let me get my gun out. Nope, it won't let me move that. Unitology. So I guess that's the religion going on with this alien marker thing that they keep talking about. Uh-oh. Oh, man. Oh, man, not those things. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Yo, bro. Sorry you died. I don't want you to come back to life, though. Um, where's Explodey? Where's the Explodey guy coming from? I see you. Okay, he's getting back into the vent, which means he's going to drop down on my butt here in a minute. But where is the question? Where'd those things go? At least there's a power node thing over there. Um, yeah. Well, guess we got to go on the lift. Oh, and it's more sticky things. No, no. Go away. Do these things like not die from this? Oh man. Run. Run, try to run. Oh, get out of my way, chair. Oh, crap. Oh, this is hurting my face and my eyes and everything that is holy with me. Is there an easier way to kill those? If there's an easier way, somebody let me know. Because I don't like having to spend like all my ammo trying to shoot these guys down. Goodness, because I tried stomping on them before, but they just keep attacking me. I don't want to use up all my stuff. Oh, I thought he was going to. Uh... Like, seriously, I have no idea how to fight these things very well at all. And, I, and it shows. It shows because I always get my butt wrecked by these things. Okay. Shoot the tentacles and they die. But why is it when I was shooting the leg tentacle things on the head, it didn't want to die? Let's grab the power node and back up the lift we go. Mr. Clark, I really. That scared me. I'm very close to you. Oh, wait, chair. And I know you want to hear what I have to say. I can explain all this. So what happened? When you mm -hmm. have the nav cards, I'll let you into the security station. We must talk. Hurry. Who are you? Looks like we gotta go through this bill or this door now. Yuck. No. Ah, no, not these things.
dude, like, seriously, no. Go away. Away with ye. All right, I gotta matrix this. Cut that limb. Cut that limb. Ow. And hopefully that thing is now dead. Let's back up. Let's grab that. And Blamo. Well, I got hurt in the process, but that should kill all of them. Did it? Hey. Ooh. Works for me. So that room is locked. Do I have a key? Oh, I do. Okay, cool. What's in this room, though? Oh, it's a bathroom. Well, I'm going to look around and see what I can find. Ew. Well, besides getting pooed on, there wasn't really anything in that room. So, let's go up this way. Call in the elevator. Let's go down. Let's make sure everything is reloaded at the same time so I don't get myself in a bad situation. All right. What's in this room? Now we see. Still hurting to. The support system in Sleep Block B has been shut down. You'll have to find an override nearby to get to the door. Okay. Sounds fair. Oh, big noise. That's not a good thing. It's never a good thing if I hear the big noise. All right, let's go through the door. What's in here? Ooh, beds. Oh no, not this thing again. Ow. All right. Uh, can you like die? Oh crap. Come on. We're still there. There we go. <laughs> no. I do not want to go into your tunnel sticky of love. No, thank you. Stop doing that. Yuck. Ew. Ew. Okay, let's get out of here because, yeah, I guess we got to get out of here now. What was the point of that? Just go in there and get drugged by that thing? Gross. So now we got to pull this down. Awesome. Well, I guess that's the point of that one. I don't know. Oh, crap. Ah, uh, no. Ooh, buddy. I don't think so. I don't think so, buddy. Take that. Where do I gotta go? All right, let's go this way. And we're back in this room. Now we gotta go through there. Let's go, let's go through the door. What does that mean? Please contact repair specialist. Entering vacuum. Oh boy. All right. Oh no, it's the fat man. Oh crap, I'm out of ammo. Oh, this is not a good day. This is not a good day. Oh no, not those little things. Crap. Run away. Oh, will you just die and leave me alone? Like, I want to go through the door, but last time I went through the door, those things still came after me. What? He's alive? Shoot that. Oh, leave me alone. How about that? How you like them apples, sir? Oh man, those things are still alive. Well, we can just do this. Bam! Oh, there's still one alive. Okay, that takes care of that. I'm running out of air. 
where is a thingy? There it is. There we go. I'm just gonna run around real quick. Life support and climate system malfunction. Hazardous condition. Please contact repair specialist. All right, let's get in through the door. There's more? Oh, there's a baby. Oh, and it's the dark kind. Can you please just die? What? Oh no, it's a fat thing. Oh my goodness. Please tell me they're dead. I did not expect him being here. Oh, do I have enough time to do it? Air can. Because these things like to come back. Okay, I think I got everything in this room. Do I need to go through here? It's telling me to go through this door. Okay. Let's go through this door then. And we'll hit the recharge station. Now it's telling me to go back out into this room. Okay. Man, that was stupid. <laughs> All right, so we got to go through one of those doors now. Oh, is this going to be another one? No, this is the elevator. Okay, never mind. I forget where I go sometimes. Oh, we got to charge our stasis. Ah! Uh, let's charge that real quick so we have it. Oh, man. Where did he go? I saw him. Bofo. Oh, there you are. Stop moving. Oh, shit. Like, seriously, these little head things. Can I just step on you? I guess not. I hate those things. I really do. Just walking through the sticky stuff. Walking through the sticky stuff. You. Just gross sound too. That's just gross all the way. Now we're back to hearing that creepy twinkle twinkle song. All right, where we gotta go now? All right. Back down we go. Oh, I forgot to upgrade. Okay, now that we upgraded the little line cutter again, upgraded its capacity. So at least we got a full mag out of that, which is nice. Um, let's visit the store real quick and we'll continue from there. So we went to the store and just got some ammo. Oh my goodness, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> And bam. Will you die? No. Let's just not. Onward we go. Where we stop? I don't know. <laughs> What's this room? Well, uh, looks like there's some inventory in here, possibly. Another bathroom. I better not get pooed on. Oh, we can open this locker. Oh, the level five suit. Dude, let's go see. Okay, so sadly we didn't have enough credits, but we're not too far off from getting those credits. So I'm hoping either by the middle of this, if we're not already towards the middle of this chapter, or the end, we should be able to get that level five suit at some point. Another text log. Z-Ball rules. Step on the lighted platform and activate it to start the game. Jump to as many scoring platforms as possible to increase your score multiplier. Then use your Kinesis module to grab the ball and shoot it into the active basket before the shot timer runs out. Beating each level opens a locker with a reward inside. Oh, so like a mini game thing and then we can get all those lockers. 
Are these lockers? Well, let's play some space basketball. Entering zero gravity. Okay, I guess we can't pick that up. All right, it's getting kind of a feel for it. Interesting. Oh, we got the nav car. Oh, crap. Oh, I should have known it was going to be some honky bull crap. Where'd he go? Oh, no, you don't. Oh, come on. Jump. Whoa. How about you die and go away? Oh man, I hate the movement in this game. <laughs> Where's the other one? There he is. There you go. You some bitch. I'm sure there's probably something to do with unlocking the rest of those. However, I'm not too concerned about that right now. Whoa, Will you shoot. Holy crap, it's like there's a lag on the shoot there. That was weird. <laughs> Dude, that was stupid. Now I know it doesn't shoot fast, but that was seemed a lot slower than before. Let's get out of here. <laughs> what? Okay. Uh-huh. This is what we have been searching for all these years. This is what, what we have in been the waiting. world. Don't listen to them. Come back. Come back. How can you be turning away from the church in this vital hour? Not... Looks like it's on a loop, huh? Well, I hear you. Oh no. God's plan nope. is unfolding and we are its inheritors. We will ascend as Damn we it. always knew we would. Unitology there we go. is truth. Is there a way to cut this off? It's the first Ow. We deter hey now. the physical methods of transformation. Soon you will be beyond more? any physical Oh, there's this concerns. one. You must have fools. This is what we have been searching there for any all more? these years. This is what we have been waiting for. Don't okay. listen to them. Come back. Come yeah, back. I'm going to like circle around <laughs> real quick. Okay, I went around, kind of circled, phase. got stuff. We We're going to go ahead and continue on. So we have a power node to go in there. Oh, okay. Gotcha, okay. Move this over. Move you over. And nice. So we got the other Ruby conductor. Got to go this way. So where do we move now? Guess we can close this one. Open this one. that one open this one what 
What's in this room? Anything? Any goodies? What was... Who is that? <laughs> who are you? <laughs> no! Ah! Oh. I had questions! Questions! <laughs> Dude, holy crap. Alright. Be most resourceful up until now, but my creation is free, reborn in the fierce of life itself. Now it's time to play your part. Oh no, he doesn't mean the regenerator thing again. Surprise, motherfucker! He does mean the regenerator thing again. Let's uh, freeze you. Oh crap! I don't even know where to go. Where do I gotta go? Is it this way? This way? Come on, tell me directions. No! No! Uh, let's go here. No! Leave me alone! <laughs> well, I kind of blocked him. So that works. Alright, we're out of ammo on that one, though. <laughs> Okay, I know we got to go back through there. I'm gonna have to move this stuff. I'm just scared. <laughs> oh, man All right, all right, let's stop being a wuss. I got this. It's just a game. It's just a game. It's not real None of this is real. Oh crap. I can't move No, I don't want you to move. I'm gonna try and move this guy All right Let's move this over here. Where is he? Please don't be near me right now. I wonder if he could bust through these things. I'm going to be very sad if he can. <laughs> I'm doing my best to just block him away. Okay, let's get through here. And then we can just... Close this up. And we'll run away. Oh crap, he's behind me. Gotta go, gotta go. Oh no, I don't care about you, little baby. Oh, I'm stuck in here. Freeze. And you freeze. Okay, I'm just all calm and cool. Calm and cool. That's how we win this. Crap. I didn't notice I was out of ammo. I'm glad I upped the capacity on this thing. Uh, run in circles. Run in circles. Why? I don't need more of you things. I'm about to run out of stasis. I did run out of stasis. I did. I did run out of stasis. Uh. Exit out. Let's go. Okay. I upgraded my stasis a little bit. Let's try and get them all together. Can you, like, not? Come on. Just, just die. You die. You die. Okay. Oh. Good. There. Nope. There's a baby there. Which door? This door. Let's go. <laughs> Let's just go. Let's get out of here. Excellent work, Mr. Clark. Excellent work. Now, okay. Come and meet me in the executive area. The door is unlocked. Be quick. Oh. Okay. Be careful with Dr. Kine. A lot of what I've discovered so far has come from his records. The man has clearly gone insane. He might be unstable, maybe even violent. Oh, yeah. But what could be worse than a violent scientist? Besides these crazy ass aliens I've been dealing with, huh? All right. Oh, 
Oh no. Oh crap. See, this is why I tried to smash all these bodies earlier. You can just die and I will be okay with that. Uh, no, I don't like any of you. All right, and with that, we got the level five. Cool. I'm glad we got that level five suit now. That should help out at least. Okay, let's go and see that Dr. Klein. Where? Okay. Wrong way. Does that say infidel? It does say infidel. <laughs> okay. Infidel. Okay, there's the doctor, I think. This room is either painted red or just covered in blood. <laughs> okay. Amelia. You made it! Oh, thank God you made it. I've been following your progress. I know you want to repair the executive shuttle and leave this place, but escape is impossible at this point. Okay. The Shuttle shock point drive is destroyed. No, 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 no. Don't use hope. Don't use hope. Don't use hope. First, okay, so no hope. I lost hope. I, I tried to scuttle the ship, sabotage the systems. But Amelia, oh, she changed things. Who's Amelia? The church! They think the market is divine! But they don't know what's happened here, what's been released! Look, 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 look. Look at this. What is that thing? That is what we found in the core of the planet. Mercer calls it the hive mind. It's the source. Oh my goodness. We were so stupid. But Amelia, she knew, she knew we could be stopped by returning the marker to the planet. The marker was containing it within the planet. Return okay. the marker and seal the hive mind. Are we gonna have to fight that thing? I'm sorry, Amelia. I bear much of the responsibility. Oh, if we have to fight that thing, that's gonna be some crazy now, stuff. I must take responsibility for ending it. And atone for my sins. Okay, how are you gonna do that, Brokey? But you can help. If you repair the shuttle and bring the marker back on board, we can end this forever. Bring the marker back on board? Did you guys put it back? I'm confused. I thought the marker was on the ship and that's why all this is happening. Are you telling me the marker is not on the ship and he wants to bring it back? Oh crap! I was not expecting that. Man, these little things take up so much ammo. It's a room full of them. I hope that worked. Okay, that might have worked. Oh, all these little things are coming in here. I got something for y'all. No, get off me. See, I'm somewhat strategic. That looks like something I'd make after eating a lot of Taco Bell. E. <laughs> Ooh, this is a nice room. Look at the fancy bed. Nice. Captain's log. 
person. Oh, it's the captain's room. I want to set the record straight. By the time this log is heard, my actions will have been vindicated. I'm a unitologist. By now, it's probably no secret that we shouldn't be in this star system. Just another illegal mining job for the company. Mm -hmm. That is until the colony found the marker. That was when the church took an interest and chose me to lead this pilgrimage. Cool pictures. They also ensured many of the mission crew were devout. My primary instruction was to get the marker up from the colony and on board the ship. Interesting. Dr. Kine, the CSO, is an expert on the original marker and was tasked with deciphering this new one. He says he's making good progress. My decision to quarantine the colony is sound. They've got some kind of epidemic down there, and I can't allow okay. it to infect the ship. Not with such precious cargo. Not Being with the marker. So close. Planet Crack takes place tomorrow. We'll continue to decipher the marker, and when we return home, we'll pass all our findings and the marker to the church. The government isn't going to cover this one up. Altman be praised. Interesting on how that works. I can't die here. Not yet. Not like this. Yeah, there's a lot of devastation that happened on this ship, it looks like. I'm still wondering, though, if I'm going to have to fight that big old thing. Because that's going to be a bit ridiculous. Well, let's go through this door. What's this room? Oh. Is this the shuttle? Interesting looking style. Gotta go into the shuttle. Well, this isn't the tram, is it? No, this is the shuttle, right? I'm confused. Well, I guess we got to put the thingy in here. Okay. Excellent, excellent. Wait there for me. I'm on my way. Oh no. Is this a survive part? <laughs> Kill everything and hope to survive. You're pointing at the pallet and then it's like, no, go this way. I'm going to run around and collect some stuff. So we got a bit of ammo from that little bit of a run around. What's in here? Uh, shuttle control. I don't know what that does. Anything else of importance in here? No. <laughs> okay. Sports Illustrated, pretty much. Oh, plasma energy. Test fire the shuttle. Should I do that? I guess so. Okay, yeah, that's what we gotta do. Ah! It's you! It's really you. Open the door. Let's get out of the door. What do we do now? What's up, bro? Oh. No, not you. Will you guys, like, chill? Goodbye. Okay, so it says to go through here. We got a test fire. Test firing shuttle engines. Ah, I got you. I got you. All right. Oh no, I'm out of stasis though. Oh crap, how am I gonna do this? Oh, I'm a moron. <laughs> I use the stasis and I'm out of stasis. I don't have any more, do I? I do! Ow! That was not what I wanted to get done to me. All right, fool. Come here, fool. You stay there. Come on. So the stasis doesn't stay for long. Oh crap. <laughs> he didn't stay. Gotta do it again. Come out here, big boy. Come out here, big boy. There you are. All right, come here, big boy. 
Oh no, I missed. And then, ah, uh, I still screwed up. All right, and then for good measure. <laughs> For good measure, so he doesn't walk around. Test firing shuttle engines. Here we go. That should do it. Hey. All right. Stand by. Why? Why are we stand by? Oh, he's come through. Yes, this will work. There's still time to Never mind the work. alien dead at the his feet. Need to be released before launch. The control platform there. I need you to guide the undocking procedure while I start the shuttle's engines. Okay. This will make us home again. Hurry! I'll take the shuttle up to the flight deck where the marker's being held. Okay. Docking clamps released. Oh, I can't leave here yet. Okay. I'm en route to the flight deck. Meet me there and we can load the marker on board. Yes, Amelia. Soon we'll take it home. Who's Amelia, though? I don't know if Kind is crazy or not, but we need that shuttle. Let's keep him on our side. For now. <laughs> right? We need the shuttle. Let's keep the crazy guy with us so that we can get the shuttle back later. Sounds like a sound plan to me. Well, I guess we gotta go to the flight deck or wherever he told us to go. Whoa. Your time has come. No need to be frightened. No reason to fight. Many have gone before us. And now it's time for us to take the voyage together. Transcend death. Let the future take its course. Join me as I gaze upon the face of God. Dude, like... You've got to calm down. Oh, no! Dude, he really just did that to himself? What the hell? <laughs> Oh my goodness, no. No. That's just no. Come on. Die. Before you even get to hurt me. No. I'm not letting him have any kind of attack on me. No. <laughs> no, no, and again, no. So I guess we're going back to the tram now? No? Yes? Yes, we are. All right. And with that, chapter 10 is done. Chapter 10, everybody. That was crazy. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Let's get on to Chapter 11 soon. Go ahead and like, share, and subscribe to me, please. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Adios.